their sleeping bags. Did, did, did we happen to get a, a new mixtape this week by any chance? I did not do a mixtape. Uh, you want to do one right now? Uh, do you want, to, you want me to just edit together a mixtape sure, now? Sure, Let's just, if we did do a mixtape, what would it sound like? It would start with some some music. Uh, oh, okay, yeah. Here, throw we'll some do music a, we'll and do, then we'll Justin can... Tape, um, here we go. Right. Live recording of a mixtape. Uh, here we know. I, I, I got I got the music uh, oh, here, uh, Bryce. Uh, By the way, uh, if you're not a patron, we have to ask that you disconnect that you right either, now. Either immediately become a patron. That's fine. Sign up now, or just 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 turn away, turn it off, don't look. All right. So I'm gonna go with um, aggressive and mystical. Oh no, there's nothing. Okay. Apparently, the aggressive mystical. Uh, uh, there's room for like, room anything for anything is possible. <laughs> if you chant, if you believe. All right, if you um, dream. All right, here we go. Uh, so it would uh, it would start start like this. Who's ready to rock? We are rocking, rocking all day. Mixtape for you in a major way. Ha! These are uh, tracks that we're literally recording live. There's no recording. We're just broadcasting them. They'll go away forever. Bye. <laughs> What's up with the snorks having both a dick and a vagina protruding out of the top of their heads because that seems that that seems like an all-purpose phallus you could put your mouth on it you yeah. could put your tongue in it you could put your snork in their snork or you could you could frot your snorks together until the bubbles came out you could tie three snorks together and then be like yeah shove them all in my snork right, well, well you still only have i guess they have three holes and two dicks if they're a boy Four holes if they're a girl. No, I think it's it's Barbie and Ken downstairs. Oh, you it's think so? All, oh, it's all on the snork. And really, what that show was about was a hedonistic lifestyle for which nobody could uh, abide on land, but in the sea, where so, everything. Okay, so you're saying away you're saying much as just stink. Much they're as like, yeah, no, we can bang each other all day down here. Much as a porpoise and a dolphin and a whale are animals that 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 graduated to the land but came back to the sea and hence their their gait that matches their their floppy up and down motion you're saying yeah. these are proto humans that exactly. said that were banished from like a, so around the time that humans were fucking neanderthals yeah there was this third smurfs <laughs> were fucking snorks that's right but and it and, then this, and they were too freaky even for the Smurfs. The Smurfs oh. are doing their giant bang, gang bang with, the, you know, because there can only be one Smurfette per village. Exactly. And everyone goes nuts and everyone else jerks off. But then, but then, uh, what is it that the Snorks are doing that gets them banished? Oh, uh, just multiple penetrations. Like, just like they're, they're looking for everyone because, like, that Snork, man. Like a like a goddamn uh, tunnel on a on an overpass, right? So like, they were they were like the Larry Flint of proto humans. They're all oh, like, dude, "Why are you guys like, doing like, the dance? Uh, it cannot be stretched wide enough. <laughs> we have no safe words." <laughs> and they said, "You know what? Get gone. Yeah, go back to the sea with you." All right. So, what do you think about coupons? <laughs> coupons? Man, I used to be the coupon king. I remember that there was coupons for five free tokens for Chuck E. Cheese's in the Sunday newspaper the day I spent the night at my friend Scott Westra's house. And amazingly, nobody anywhere in the neighborhood got their newspaper that day <laughs> because there was literally... all went out like a bunch of raccoons in search of tokens and grabbed them all up. We, I mean, we were just kids. We didn't know. We just ran up and down. We were like, I got 12 of them. <laughs> They're everywhere. Go to page 25. 
Wait, you just got the whole newspaper, yes. right? Yes. Like, not even, not even just the one thing that you needed that nobody would have noticed was missing. You literally just like, and by the way, uh, this is not known a lot, but uh, you've told me this story before. I hate to break the floor of the wall, uh -oh. but I'm going to tell everybody now. That was the day that John F. Kennedy died. <laughs> yes. Also, I, th I've been living a lie. Uh, with, with, it's double awkward because, number yeah. one, you just out of the fact that I'm 15 years older than I tell everyone. Yeah. I, I uh -huh. identify as a 41-year-old man. Uh -huh. In reality, you're not. You're, you're much, much, much older. I'm a 63 year old woman. Yeah, and uh, I've, I, I'm glad to be honest to have this off my chest. Also, uh, I also created Chuck E. Cheese's. Uh, yeah, Nolan Bushnell ripped me off shortly after the Kennedy assassination. Yeah, and uh, I, I, I vow my revenge. Well, as for your first secret, John C. Dvorak called it number two. Uh, <laughs> if you like stole all the newspapers when John F. Kennedy died. How long was it on your neighborhood before this is pre-internet? This is probably pre-radio. I'm not good at history. Well, what like, I would do is I, I would just hold off until somebody crossed me. And then they like, you know, maybe they'd inconvenience me. Maybe they cut me off at the grocery you, store. You'd be playing stickball as everybody did when sepia tone was the only way that you recorded things. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, and you would knock the, the ball into the, a mean old neighbor's yard, mean old Miss McGregor. And she'd be like, yo, boys. Yeah. And then she'd eat the ball or something <laughs> yeah. weird. And that, I'd be yeah. like, oh, you done it now, Missy McGreg. JFK is dead. And, she, and she's like, wait, what? I was like, search your heart, because that's you can always tell. If you ever pause to think about, is JFK alive? You would you would know, but then she searched inside, and she felt that there was no connection in her heart between her and JFK, and she knew that I was right. Miss McGregor turned out to be George Lucas. Connect the dots. <laughs> What's the most dangerous thing you ever tried? Most dangerous thing? Yeah, like uh, like looking back on it, I, I went snowboarding like last month and uh, I could barely do it and stand up and i remember being a kid and just blazing down skiing just just snow skiing like a like a hellion uh who loved snow uh because snow had frozen over hell and and <laughs> and it, and happened. and you had fallen in love with a <laughs> snow minx a race of snow faring hell explorers sent from the alps yeah, to, dude, you think you think snow skiing is extreme when you're a human. Try being someone who's like literally made of fire and then you just wallow around. Yeah. It's not oh, I'm good. sure that your sinew was just shivering and you just looked so adorable. And you would wear a hat made of a child molester's skin. <laughs> and he was still alive too. And you'd be like, like, ah, like, I repent, ah, I repent. Somebody, all my family. I and you're repent. like, oh, not again. I was like, I'm not repenting this double black diamond. Woo! <laughs> yeah, no, that, uh, that, that definitely sounds legit. This has been a mixtape. Yeah, you can only get these it. These mixtapes. You're not on the damn intro. We did the whole thing right. Oh, no, I'm not supposed to be here. I'm not you're here. Not here. Pretend, no, pretend I'm not here. where I recorded, but. Fine. No, you're here now. Like, I, what are you going to say just, on I, the I, outro? I, 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 well, normally I hover over you in ghost like. Uh, I, I pretend like I'm not there, but secretly I'm masturbating while you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Bonnie, you're definitely not here. You're never in the mix. No, tapes. Bonnie's so. Why is <laughs> this intro's ruined? I'm going upstairs. Nobody knock on my door. Bye.
Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs>